morning. Um, okay, so I'm staying at a friend's house uh, for the weekend, and so that's why my backdrop's different. But I could not wait to open this, and so that's why I'm not waiting until I get home to do it. It came in the mail um, the day, or yesterday, whenever I left. Or, no, not yesterday, the day before, but... I still had already had my computer packed and so I was like, you know what, I'll just film this whenever I get down there. So um, it's that time when the earring of the month comes in and I got this super adorable package in the mail. Whenever I saw it, I'm like, oh my gosh, that's adorable. I mean, that, it's so cute. I am super psyched. I actually, oh. I love it. I This is probably one of my favorite packagings of this so far. So just, I feel bad about opening it. Like that's how cute this is to me. It's got like that elegant feel of it. I might keep the uh, little flower outer lining for some, like scrapbook or something. If I get back into scrapbooking. I've done it. I enjoy it. It's just, with all the digital stuff nowadays, it's hard to, um, do the physical ones as much as used to. Okay, so first thing I see my little, not only is it the pot, the bubble wrap, but it's also the little bag that I like. So I'm pretty psyched about that. I'm glad that they brought that back because it was a couple of them that they didn't. Um, all right, so once again, got the cards that this one, um, I don't show this side as much, but basically this gives it, if I don't like the earrings as much as I think someone else would, this gives a card that um, I can send it to them and they can figure out where I originally got it from. So I think that's pretty cool, especially since it's kind of giving the, hey, this is why we do what we do. And if you hear any noise in the background, like I said, I'm staying at my friend's house and they have cats. And one of the cats, um, he's wanting an in and attention and stuff. And right now I'm like, I've got video to film. So I was playing with him earlier, so don't make be upset with me. Um, okay, so once again, whoop, my camera's over here. Got the one that shows the map and talks about Mercy House. And the links will be down in the description about this stuff. I highly suggest y'all checking it out. So far, I have been very impressed with what I've been got. Or, what what I've got. Not what I've been got. What I've got. Okay. So, here it goes. Taking it out. This one has Badala on it. The other ones have been saying like Mercy House and stuff, but this one has an imprint of Badala. Um, so it's a little different, although I will say this much, the strings on this one are a bit nicer than the other ones. The other ones have been kind of scraggly, like more of a, um, oh, I can't think of what the material is. The um, burlap. It's closer to burlap string, which doesn't make much sense, but I don't know that's what it is, but it's not as soft as this. Like, it is very sturdy, though. All right, so um, this one came from Honduras. Very cool. At least I'm pretty sure that's what that says. The writing's a little easier to read this time than the Tanzania. All right, so this is what they look like. Ooh, okay, this is pretty cool. Um, it has kind of the feel of um, almost like pyrite, but more of a, it's almost like a silver pyrite, which pyrite is also known as fool's gold. But I am, I ha I'm a biochemist. I have a background in geography or geology excuse me I apparently cannot talk this morning and so this is really cool I work at a sand mine and so anything earth related like with the rocks and stuff like that I think is pretty awesome 
And so this is, this one is probably one that fits my personality better than, well, no, there's a couple other ones that fit. So far I have been very, like I said earlier, I've been very impressed with what I've got. These are also studs, which is the first set of studs I've got. All the other ones have been hanging. And, um, so I'm actually really excited because I can wear these today. I am, I actually probably will. <laughs> um, I'm at, I'm super excited about it. And, um, like they're, they're light, kind of like my other ones. I don't really even realize they're there though, but they've got that kind of, um, natural feel to them. And, uh, so I'm, these are definitely in my top, like top three, I would say. Um, I don't have my other earrings here to show you my other ones, but, um, I have worn those blue and gold, or uh, it's not gold, it's like a brownish, but the turquoise brownish ones, I will put a link over, or video here, um, indicating that one so you can go check that out. But I really do like these. I am super psyched. And, um, so yeah, so earring of the month going, and basically it's a fair trade thing, so my money is going to help those, um, who are in impoverished areas actually be able to have their jobs. And so it's going directly to them instead of, um, like them getting paid like really horrible wages and then, um, really bad situations. So, um, this, I'm super excited what this company does and, um, yeah. So anyway, um, I'm psyched. I give this one two thumbs up and I will definitely be wearing these all day today. Just especially since they're studs, they don't have that droopy filling for the earlobe. And so droopy, droopy, droopy filling. Um, I seriously cannot talk. I had one sip of coffee, so I'm not even fully awake this morning. Um, but anyway, so yeah, so that's what they are. I am super psyched and Honestly, the more I think about the fact that they're studs, not the ones that hang down, because that means that they're a lot lighter on the ear and don't put as much pressure, they're actually going up to probably my favorite so far. And so, <laughs> just the fact that they're studs made a huge difference on that, but for sure in the top three. So anyway, so I will see y'all later, and um, have a good one, and... Uh, <laughs> Like I said, go check these links out. They're going to be in the description below. All right, bye. <laughs>